Good evening, fellow true yesers. Yes, Nicola! The Supreme Court has ruled that Scotland cannot hold its own referendum, and I, for one, could not be happier. I unite the clans! Now I can kick the independence can down the road and keep stringing you all along until the 2024 general election. Yes, Nicola, you've outwitted them all! I'll tell you that independence has never been more vital, and yet I'll wait two years before actually doing anything about it. You're playing seventh dimension chess, Nicola! If the Supreme Court had ruled that we could hold our own referendum, I would have shat myself. Nobody would blame you for the smell, Nicola. It'd be Waste Monster's fault. But now I can just get you all riled up by going on about democracy and Scotland's voice not being silenced. Oh, they fear us, Nicola. Safe in the knowledge that you idiots have forgotten how I've turned the SNP into a party so undemocratic that I would personally condemn it if it was in a third world country. For the boost, Nicola! And you can't even remember how I silenced the SNP's own membership, ensuring that your voices are never heard unless it's of benefit to me, like tonight. Unchain the unicorn! I won't have to answer for my policy failings, my personal failings, or for the fact the country is basically held together with scotch tape. We invented that scotch tape, not British tape! Our seats upon the gravy bus are safe for many years to come. Scottish buses! I've ensured the salaries, the expenses and the fat pensions keep rolling in until at least 2028. That's it, Nicola! Free in 2033! I'll stand down in 2024 to high praise from all of you, even though I've done fuck all to advance the cause of Scottish independence. I hold you all in such utter contempt, and yet here you all are, cheering me on like the absolute fucking turnips you are. Aye, best speech I've ever heard, best speech I've ever heard, aye, aye. We are fucked.